Hi, this is Somer Hackley, CEO at Distinguished Search. I've always been fascinated with why people do what they do. Welcome to Two Distinguished Minutes, where I have a distinguished guest. We talk about why they do what they do. We touch on how they do it. We all leave inspired and we all learn something. Well, today my guest is Will Rollins reese He is the Chief Product Officer at LineBridge. Well, Will, it is great to see you here today. Thanks for joining me. Oh, thank you for having me, Summer. Real privilege to talk with you today. So I would love to ask you, why do you do what you do? I think the thing that you know really excites me is, is when you can get what I call that kind of aha moment, right? When, you know, like I'm excited about solving problems, challenging assumptions, really thinking differently about you know, how to undertake an activity or, or solve a customer need or a problem they don't even know that they have yet. And, and when you can bring together some of your existing kind of Lego bricks, when you can build some new ones, tell your story differently and you get to a, you know, you get to a customer or a user and they, and they have that kind of aha moment that you've just done something which is going to make a real difference. That's what I live for. Right. And when you can do that and someone feels that you've really done something very personable for them that has solved their problem, but yet you're doing it at scale for everybody, then you're starting to hit home runs. If I could do that all day long, that's that's kind of what I like doing. Businesses are in what I call permanent transition. They're permanently having to evolve and adapt. And the only way you can adapt and change meaningfully is to start thinking differently about your problem. In every, everything that I do, every meeting I have, every roadmap I review, every feature set, every customer meeting, I'm trying to understand their why and what's stopping us from doing it differently or what's stopping you from doing that differently. You know, so if I can bring that challenge, right, and bring that, that thought process that starts breaking down either stated or unstated assumptions and so that we can free have that free space to then start getting creative and think about what that next solution set is. For me, if, if I can just be an ignition spark to sort of spark a differentiated idea process, a differentiated outcome, and then really let the, the experts and the and all the all the all the teams with all their knowledge then build and own that so it's their idea, right? Then 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 I'm happy. Well, Will, it's a great message. I love how you spoke about those aha moments. So thank you for being here today and joining me. I really appreciate it. Summer, it's my, my, my pleasure. Thank you again for having me.